people have missed a few days. I'm falling behind, but real life. All right. But I'm going to try to keep on a better schedule now that things have cleared up a bit. Hold it right there. We've seen this, but I'm going through it anyway. Whoa, easy. Nice landing. Considering the fact I was flying on fumes and half the controls were broken, I'd say I did a good job. Well then, glad you're okay. Sorry for your helicopter. Wasn't really mine. Sorry for crashing into your house. Not really mine. Hey, you think you can lower the gun now? I mean you no harm. You look harmless, all right. Thanks. My name's David. Catherine, or just Kate. Actually, uh, do I know you? Yeah, actually, I don't think I'm going to repeat all this. There's a lot of text. Hold on. I realized no one was likely to start in the middle of the video. In the middle of the video series, sorry. Alright, first deviation in lines is telling about the dream. Okay, I was here in the house and all of a sudden it got cold. Or very cold. Freezing cold. I think this might happen tonight. I might sound like a lunatic, I know, but I trust me, I know I'm right. We're going to find out for ourselves if you're right. There we go. Let's go then. We should prepare for your prophecy. What about the outpost? It's out there. We'll keep a lookout for it. Yeah, all the dialogue has been the same up to this point. I realized I was going to waste like three to five minutes of everybody's time. Alright. Definitely going to have to take all that crap down, but I'm going to wait until I've got some help. I don't need all of this crap, but I don't know what I do need, so... Empty freaking gas can. I'll empty gas can, you in a minute. I have no idea what I'm saying. I'm babbling like an idiot. Alright, I don't see how... Whoa, there's dead spiders all over the place. Yikes. I think I could reset the bear traps. I'm not safe. I'm not dead. She told us about the house and the rubber joint, just like this time. I'm so hot, cause I'm in hell. I forgot to bring names. I wasted a, a slingatory slot on my hammer. Alright, do I need to go back to the gas station? I don't, oh yes, yes I do. For gasoline. There we go. Run, do more. There we go. Wrench. There we go. down over here. I'm going to take five minutes and walk back to the bridge. Ten minutes and walk back to the bridge. There we go. I was too paranoid about what I might need. Definitely not going to need the hammer since I don't have any hands. Don't think I'll need the duct tape, but it's Probably not worth a trip back for it. Let's go help the king. I should check out the front door first. Yeah, way to lead me by the nose. I'm gonna pause it again because this is all the same. Later days. Alright. Wow, I haven't thought about the weekenders in a long time. Small winter. I always squeeze through there, but I can't reach high enough. <laughs> Too heavy. Okay. You look like a good, strong dumpster pusher. David, do you still do you have any clue how stupid your ideas are? See that window over the door? I could squeeze through it, but I need to be able to reach it first. Oh, you should have started with that. I'll be happy for the. I'll, I'll help you for the sheer fun of watching you try to squeeze through that window. That's great. Now see if you can climb it without. Climb it without breaking your leg. Man, she's mean. An empty gas heater? That wasn't there before. Huh. Gas heater portal. Without the gas bottle, it's not very useful. Hey, we got a gas bottle last time. And we never needed it. Open a cupboard. Open a cupboard. Open it. It's locked. Son of a biscuit. It's not locked. Knife. Matt blocked. And while I'm old, I am not that old. I've never actually watched Matlock. 
the glass seems to be hardened. Take five minutes. Just watching him go at it for five minutes. Mm, 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 swinging in. A can of meat. Meat can. No, no, it'll take five minutes. You're eating up all my time. Five minutes of time. You, I've opened the can of meat. Who are you talking to? At least I can pick a different option for how I got through this. Hi. How'd you get how'd you get there? I'll just be honest. I use the back door. Oh, I didn't know there was a back door. Well, more like a back window. Wow, you're like a burglar. Come on, it's all abandoned anyway. And wait, why am I explaining myself to you? Did you find any food in there? Here you go, dude. Take this. What is that? Food! Wow, you're a good person after all. I wouldn't say good, maybe a bit clumsy and soft. Come with us, Cody, you'll be safer. We might even have more food. Awesome! Everything is awesome. Whoa. Wait, examine the cobwebs, dude. Hopefully no spiders around. Not this again. I hope there aren't any spiders left here. I've seen the corpses around the hideout, and I wouldn't want to meet them face to face, to be honest. Maybe it's just leftover webs. Leftover not, they're blocking our way. You think we can do something to get rid of them? They look kind of strong enough to trap an adult man in place. I think we should come back tomorrow. Maybe we can dissolve it somehow? My guess is the spaghetti of webs will dissolve on its own by tomorrow. Just keep this place in mind. That's not how spider webs work. Just keep this place in mind. We'll try again later. But again, that's not how spider webs work. Alright. The, use the pipe on the release mechanism. Pipe fits perfectly into the opening. The rope. We've got the flag, but the pipe is forever stuck. It looks like the pipe is stuck here for good. Alrighty. Hey, sad sack. Again, I'm gonna skip the depressing part, or skip the rip, rip hit, the repetitive depressing part. All right. I looted things from the house. The only difference was not significant enough. I, I felt to justify recording, and that was instead of the broken fan, there's a broken heater. Exact same difference, just thir uh, a few minutes with the screwdriver, and it's fixed. Yes? That's all for now. Oh, and I forgot to check his wife's body. Don't go near that house. Please go away. All right. Yeah, I'm not giving him the, the derp voice this time. That's not cool. Did you distract him? I know how to distract him. Did you do without a gun? All right, Mr. Boring. Hey. I forgot I had to search her body. And there were coats in the cabinet, just like last time. Coats I didn't need. Small locket. There we go. Now put the sheet back. Boom. Gotta go. Now he's just going to get pissy again, but I'll, I'll go ahead and go through it this time just because I don't want to do more jump cuts. I know I probably shouldn't, but I, I thought it might be important, but it might be important. I want you to take a closer look at that locket. Oh, I want to take a closer look at the locket before I give it to Barry. No, there we go. Barry, I'm sorry if you're reading this. It probably means I didn't make it. Don't let it be your demise. Remember me and live a good life, and when the time comes, I know you'll make the right decision. All right, there we go belongs to your wife. You should look inside and... Where'd you get it? Um, there's no inside. I thought... Where did you get it? Listen, I... There's a note inside. I think you should read what it says. Did you sneak into my house and touch my wife? Stop it. Did you? Barry, wait. Stop it. So you go through her stuff like a scavenger? You're so dead. You're so dead. There we go. Sorry. Uh, look, idiot. If I were a scavenger stealing stuff, I wouldn't hand it to you, you stupid. I'll shoot you. Please stop shouting. No, wait. Barry, just read the damn note. Do it, please. Just read the note. Dot, dot, dot. My sweet girl. My honey. Why you... I'm sorry for taking that, but I thought you should have it. No, no. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have gotten mad like that. If it wasn't for you, I probably never would have seen my wife's final words. It's her handwriting for sure, but when did she write it? How did she know? Sometimes people can sense things before they happen, right, David? It's almost like I read a goodbye letter. 
a letter that you've delivered. Thank you. Your wife deserves a proper burial. I, I can't. I can't look at her like this. Lifeless. Cold. I'll bury her. What? David, are you serious? We don't have the time for... The man has lost everything. Show some respect. I'm gonna ask... I'm not gonna ask you your help with this. Just don't try to stop me. Eh, I'll help. I just hope we don't waste too much time. You have a shovel, Barry? Huh? Oh, I have one right here. I also wasted an hour, 30 minutes both ways going back to the house because I thought the shovel was in storage. I am a dense mother fluffer. Okay. Dig. I'm not a dwarf and I'm digging a hole. Diggy, diggy hole. Digging a hole. Corpse hole. Diggy, diggy hole. Diggy, diggy hole. Digging a hole. Alright, there we go. Kate, okay, help me move his wife? Yeah, sure. Let's take her outside. Alright, Barry. You are very, 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 very. Hey. Yes? Hey, come on. It's time. Okay. Thank you. She deserved at least that. Of course she did. Come on, Barry. Let's go. Where? Or where? I got a plan, sort of. The first part of the plan is to survive tonight. All right. I'll do it for her. Hey, mister. Yes? I'm Cody. Hello, Cody. I'm Barry. You want some food from a can? I left some for later, but I can share. That's sweet of you, but I'm not hungry right now. Eating makes me happy, and I thought it would also make you happy. <laughs> Your son, David? No, we found him near the restaurant near here. By the restaurant near here. I'll tell you the details later. Cody, you're a good kid. I think I'll eat that food now. Go for it. Come on, David, lead the way. Cody seems very oblivious. And he's like, I think he's... 13, 14, 13, 12, 13. Anyway, he should understand that food ain't gonna fix a sad heart. Uh, what do we got left? 22 minutes, 7 hours, 22 minutes? Alright, that's all the time in the world. Why did I leave the back door locked? Can I collect the trap? That trap has caught something disgusting. I need a tool or something to reset the spring. Twelve minutes? Oh, okay. Do I want to reset this to prepare the trap by stretching the spring? Yoink. I had just assumed I wouldn't be able to do nothing. Alright. Barry is by far the best helper. Is this the place you were talking about? Or this you talking about? Yes. Big. Looks solid. Despite Kate's best attempts, it still stands. And I think it provided some protection you need. At least until we figure out what to do next. I knew the people who lived here. Really? I'll tell you about him if you want. Nope. Do not need to hear that again. Alright. Putting things in one at a time sucks. Alright. Um, can't see how that would work. Um, can't see how that would work. But it's a gas heater. A tank filled with propane. Well, I'll tell you what. All right. Um, until further... No oh, no, I definitely will need the... I don't even know what I need anymore. Money. In the kindling basket it goes. Oh. Okay. So wait, I can't put the stuff in the basket? You suck. Alright, wait a minute. Ah, I'm bad at this. I need too many things. Needful things. No point in leaving this locked. And I'm a twit who just locked it. I am dense. There we go. Hold on, I'm going to dump inventory. And now I can pick up the plonks. Plonk. 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 
I'm ready to assume I can use these to start a fire. Put broken planks into the fireplace. There's already fuel in there. Instead of burning everything once, I should put... Oh, that's why I couldn't put it in the kindling box before. Oh, the money. I was almost positive the money was... It's just, that's a vague memory from when I played ages ago. Back when it was a flash game. Oh, okay, it's for starting the fire. Put a water cache in the fireplace. Okay, I can remove the nails. We need a tool for that. Fine. It'll take nine minutes. Besides the nails, the barricade was not salvageable. So, why did you just plunk them on the floor like some kind of nail heathen? Seriously, just have them in my inventory when, I, when I'm done taking crap apart, you idiot. Bah, misclicked. Six hours, 40 minutes, dang. Alright, now I got the nails. Galvanized nails. All right. All right. We're doing good now. I don't need this blanket on me at the moment. Don't think I need the shovel. The nails are barely any weight at all, but the truck is going with us. So if it turns out I need any of this crap. I can unload it later. Alright. We'll move right along. Getting there is half the fun. Come share it with me. These tracks weren't here yesterday. The road ahead is blocked. Maybe somebody was trying to go around the crash. It's possible. Let's follow the tracks and see where they take us. That's my life motto. Let's follow the tracks and see where they take us. That's my life motto. Yes, thank you. Looks like their trip didn't end well. I wonder what happened. Duh. My guess is their car broke down. RVs are not best suited for off-road travel. They set up a camp and then the spiders got them. We don't have much of anything. Not like we can do for anything for a guy. You sure you don't want to bury him because we have so much time on our hands? Kate, we buried wife's, his, Barry's wife to help him. So why are they not getting to their own funeral? Don't be snarky, okay? They're worth it, we just don't have time. Hear that, guys? Sorry, it's past our grave digging time for today. Whatever, Catherine. He's dead, no valuable belongings. First aid kit. There is some stuff in it, then take it, stupid. Bandage, ooh. Thermal blanket, ooh. Nothing else. Ooh. A jacket. A jacket. A big blanket. Big, big blanket. Bling, 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 blanket, blank, blanket. All right. I don't think there's any point in starting the RV this time around. Go. Should have known I'd need my tools. Can't remember if I need the wrench, screwdriver, or what have you, so I'm just gonna take all of them. No, I don't need the hammer at the moment. Alright. I don't even. Yeah, I do definitely need the rope hook, come to think of it. Detach the hook. There we go. Did I forget to get the rope from the restaurant? I had to have. I am so dense. All right. Thermal blanket. Wait, how does a thermal blanket weigh less than a bandage? That makes no damn sense. Go here. As long as I got all the people with me. 
it'll make the trip a, it'll make the repairs a lot faster. Do you want to use the hammer nails to improve your makeshift bridge? Require one handful of nails would allow you to travel through the ravine with a vehicle if you have one. Yes. Five hours even. Ugh. I suck at this. Yep, there's the rope right there on the ground. Because this dummy can't claim things in one go. I think Kit's right about him being an idiot. I'm kind of clumsy and useless. Alright, we got five hours left. That's gotta be something. Alright. Duct tape. Another blanket. Electrical cord. I don't see myself needing a shovel at the moment. All right, we're gonna want all the doors closed when it gets really cold. But all right, blanket. Use green blanket on window. You know what? Just run over there, stupid. It's just hanging there. I need to do something to attach it to the wall. Duct tape. There we go. Yeah, that looks secure. Alright. I thought I had more blankets than this. Oh, I've right, already in my inventory. Okay. Although it probably couldn't hurt to start setting up stuff like the heater and whatnot. Don't need the bandage yet. Do not need nails. Excuse me, I burped and I apologize for it. Um, blanket. It's just hanging there. I need to do something to attach it. Yeah, you don't have to say that every time, Dingus. It'll take 35 minutes. You want to use the duct tape fish to start several legs of the window because the window frame is a bit worn and it'll take a bit more time. Alright. One more blanket. Blue blanket. Man, that guy from the director, the producers, is going to freak out about his blue blanket. Haven't seen the producers? I highly recommend it. Four hours and one minute left. Oh, man. I wasted so much time being stupid. All right. It's muffin time. It's muffin time. Do I need to tape it down? Covering this with cloth should be sufficient. No need to do anything else. Fine. It'll be that way. I was just trying to be thorough. I'm going to need those coats. And I'm definitely going to need that tank of gas. Alright. Put the pest control sticky note into the kindling box. Alright. Drop that. Oh, I should pick it up first. Okay, my bad. But when I try to use it on my I'm going to have to pause it and figure out how to place the stupid tank. But I'm going to get everything else done first. Actually, I think I've done everything else. Where do I plug in the heater? There we go. No, it's not a socket. Papers! I need this. There was a paper clip holding them together. The documents are don't have anything useful, just invoices. Yeah, but... I could still use them for the fire, dummy. There we go. Alright, I'm going to figure out what the heck I'm supposed to be doing next. One moment, please. Turns out it was simply a matter of click propane bottle on heater, and it installs it in it. Okay, I did not know that. I'm a dunce. I am a dunce. 
plug that in. Even though there's no power yet. There we go. There's a heater placed on the floor. It's not working. Yeah, well, that's because I haven't turned the power on in the house yet. You dingus. Hey, take this coat. Thanks, but I think you should give one to Cody first. Somebody call me? What about you? I'll be fine. I can always find more coat. We can always find more coat. That's not necessarily true. Dude, don't make me change the order. I have enough coat. Just tell them you have enough coats for everybody. Take this coat. It's too big for me. I know, but you'll... It's too big for me. I know, but you'll have to wear it when it gets really cold. Okay. You're pretty good with kids, David. I don't know, am I? Hey, I'm not a kid. Here you go, kid. Oh, you shouldn't have. Wear it when it gets really cold. I know, thanks. I want the red one myself. It's my favorite color. Take this coat. Okay, it's getting rather chilly already. Yeah, it's only getting worse. Thanks. Alright, do I have anything else I need to plug in? <laughs> Ooh. Tied the rope with hook. I just remembered. The chimney is clogged. That would have sucked. Sucked to find out too late. I'm going to close that hatch when I come back. Wow, the cracked moon even looks frozen. Excuse me, I do apologize. There we go, dead bird. Don't really need it, but hey. Okie dokie, let's see. How long have I been recording? 27 minutes? Alright, well, I'm so close to the end, though. I might as well not split this one up. Alright, now the fireplace should work. Walk this down. I'm gonna set it away from the fireplace. Not, not actually required, but do. All right. Do I have even any? We don't have any blankets left for using as blankets. But okay. Did I close all the doors? I did not. I can be one dense potato. I'm gonna double check the car to make sure I didn't leave anything in the flatbed. That would have sucked. I got the heater and everything, and then I would have failed to gas up and switch the power from the sprinklers to the house. Yay! First try that time. Heck yeah. Heck yeah at all. I am awesome. I'm surprised I don't need to put towels under the door for this part, but they didn't give me any towels. Kind of jerks that way. All right, let's see if we got everything done, shall we? Save complete. Now let's see if I did everything. This is our blowing high, nice hot air. All right, I have saved. And I need a coat. All right, it was cold already during the day, but when the sun disappeared behind the horizon, temperature dropped lower. Got so cold, everything in the area was, that was alive that hadn't found shelter was frozen almost instantly. Found shelter in the house, so we would save you from the cold wave of cold death. Front door was closed. We can live cold by 2%. Back door was closed, 2%. Window was covered with a thick blanket. And the leg was taped to the wall with duct tape. Locked 6%. With a silver thermal blanket. The thermal blanket was, was taped with duct tape. As a result, blocked 6%. Blah, 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 6%. Yep. Put a restaurant flag in the opening. I'm trying not to blah 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 over stuff, but it's literally just repeating the blanket line. You put a restaurant flag in the opening in the ceiling. The large hole in the attic. The hatch was important to airflow. It stopped about 6% of the initial wave. The fireplace was not lit. One second. Alright. I had to go back to the gas station to get the lighter. But when I went there, I saw I also needed to get the bag of charcoal. So let's see if this goes any better this time. Do 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 cold blah 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 front door back door I already read all this Alright fire was burning in the fireplace generally a lot of heat 30% there we go 
Your night sudden gust of wind almost put out the fire. Did a lot of spare kindling for such an occasion. We had a lot of occasions. Could we light the fire or make the flame bigger? You didn't lose any heat. The basket by the fireplace was full of fuel to burn, and kept the fire going until dawn. Plugging an electric heater. The hot air at blue raised the temperature around it, directing 22% from the initial wave, cold wave. A portable gas heater was placed in one of the rooms. Warmth from the gas heater dispersed about 24% of the freezing air. Heck yeah! Wasn't bad as you thought it would be. Conditions outside were harsh, but in your hideout, everything was in your hideout, everything was absolutely fine. Got a bit chilly, but you didn't even need to put the coat on. Oh my god, I did good. You were able to rest much more comfortably and plus five kilograms carry weight. Which is especially good because that reset after the world ended. Stairs, this is new. Do 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 Scooby dooby dooby do do Hey! Barry's wife. Did he even get did he even name her at any point? Maggie, right, right. Hello, dear. Wait, what, you're... I must be dreaming. Indeed you are, my dear. I know you. I, I buried you. You're Barry's wife. You did bury me, honey. I'm quite grateful for that. No, no problem. It's a dream? Yes, darling. You're quite... It's quite obvious once you look around and think for a second. You've been here before, but your memory is failing you. It's from your dream traveling. You gotta watch out as you do it. It can lead to dementia. I don't understand. I hope you will, because a lot depends on it. Barry's your husband. I yes, thank you. And for some reason you're in my dream. Well, not personally. I'm dead, remember? This is an echo of Barry. I'm an echo of Barry's memory of me. Well, why are you here? I'm here because you let Barry die, honey. What? No. That's impossible. He's fine. Oh, na maybe now he's fine. But you didn't survive your previous life. Previous life? You've been here before. Deep inside, you know it's true. What's going to happen? Can you tell me? You care for your friends, darling. You're a good man. And I don't want that boy to get hurt either. But if you try, you could save my husband, too. Just don't let him go there. Go where? The sand tomb. Don't let him go there. Tell him to wait. Oh, dear. I think our time has run out. They've found you. Who is that? He's a reference to another game. I mean, I mean, run, David. Don't let this thing touch you. And please, warn Barry. Also tell him I love him. And it wasn't his fault. I can't run. Let me just say now, while well, it's a pause, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed, like, comment, and subscribe. Or not, I'm not the boss of you. Good night. Whoa, bugs! Uh-oh. That's not good. So you had another bad dream? Yes, and not a pleasant one. There were these people. Thugs. Bandits. They raided our hideout. They had guns, and they wanted to kill us. So we'll have to defend ourselves. What is it, Cody? You seem excited. I have something important to tell you, like super-duper important. We have to prepare for tonight, even more than yesterday. Yes, Cody, I know. But you don't know why yet. I don't? I thought... Shush, I had a dream. There were like dozens of zombies coming toward the house. They wanted my brain. We have to protect it. I don't want to be eaten. They these ugly faces, and they were slowly walking towards, walking with their arms in front of them. They were speaking to me, all like, brains. That's not speaking. That's just repeat, speaking to you. That's just repeating the same thing over and over again. Cody, Cody, zombies are not real. You had a bad dream, that's all. What? No, why? Your dreams are better than mine? I'm not saying they're better. So you believe me there are zombies coming after me? No one is chasing you, Cody. I hope the zombies will think you're tasty. David, there's something I have to tell you. I also had a dream. You saw what I saw? No, I saw a city. A sand tomb. I know where to find the spaceship, David. Rocket. Or shuttle. At least I know where to look for it. What? Where? Sidewheel. The corporation that built those ships had a number of outposts and offices across, the, well, everywhere, really. In my dream, I saw one of them in the deserted city in the southwest. Just an office, but if we get there, we might find the location of the spaceship. So you don't know for certain. David, have I doubted your dreams for one second? I need you to trust me on this one. we got to get there as soon as possible. Before we spend any time preparing for what's coming tonight. Alright, thank you very much, and good night.